I'm off duty and checking out Tatler's off menu. That's my work at the registration! Yay! Now this has been the biggest I've seen my work. Hello fishing fish! So Tatler's off menu brings together 14 chefs and they've been paired to come up with an off menu dish so to speak. Each guest gets this passport so you only get one of every dish. One of the perks of this event is the free-flowing drinks. I'm getting myself a Chandon Garden Spritz to pair off with my next dish. I'm a big fan of Margarita Forest and although I can't eat Gata, I think Margarita is the only person who can make me eat this dish. That being said, dishes cannot be adjusted to your dietary restrictions, but let's move on to the next dish. At this station, I caught this interaction. Chef, what is uh, Moringa? This is one of the rare events that you get to interact with the chefs themselves and watch them prepare the dish right in front of you. Thank you! The next dish I had is quite interesting. It's like this tamarind-based ramen uh, made by Chef George Mendes. This is him. In collaboration with Chef Josh Poutwood, who was not at the station when I was filming. I head on to another watering hole. This is the Don Paparam station where I picked up their Darker Dawn cocktail. Now I'm time to be brave and have another coconut based dish. This is Chef Bettina Argueles who partnered with Chef Yoji Kitayama. Their dish is called the Kiloing Tomo that has yellowfin tuna, lobster, mackerel on top of this rich coconut milk. My last station of the night brings me to Chef Nico Kahlo and Chef Nico Santos's station where I had a duck confit chukadon and because it was the last station there was a queue but it was all worth it because just look at this dish. To cap my night I went on to the Nespresso booth to have some cappuccino decaf because I'm gonna go to sleep and that's my experience at Tatler's Off Menu. See ya!